Welcome Sagittarius to this business a reading for the third portal. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Wow. All right, my darling Sagittarians. All right, so we see some new offers is going to be coming in. We see positive news is going to be coming up. This is going to be wonderful for this portal. Whatever that was happening, whatever that was affecting you, um, Sagittarians, I see some positive emotions that is going to be coming up, especially when it comes to work and career. Good news could be coming in um, about money, for money for some of you Sagittarian, however this is happening. But I see some of you could be starting at a new place and I see balance is coming in. As we leave the, the quarter, because this is for the breeding April, May and June, as we leave the quarter, I see a renewal. So some of you are definitely going to be changing jobs. Some of you are going to be beginning a new job in the month of April. And some of you are definitely going to be changing jobs as we move um, May, June. So openings are coming up. Opportunities are coming up. New starts are coming up. This is positive. Um, these are new starts. These are situations that you are looking for in your life and this is going to be absolutely bit, um, good because I see awakening of the of uh, um, you awakening to what it is you were meant to do or meant to be or where you were meant to be okay and this is good because I see some of you could be changing careers changing jobs and you're going to be much happier than what was transpiring in your life whatever these energies comes up is all about new changes it's all about you uh, making changes that is going to make you feel better emotionally at work or at play. Um, some of us, we love the things we do. And um, some of you are going to be changing your parts and choosing to do the career that fits you the most, that you feel the most happiest from. And this is going to be good. Then we have this energy uh, in uh, May. And what is transpiring is that some of you could be mentors um some of you could change career to become a teacher to mentor to coach um that sort of a situation is coming back because some of you are working as a master or will work in a mass with the energy of a master in order to create a lot but i see that information wisdom is coming out information so i really see that some of you could become a master or could become a coach that is helping you um, to clear things, okay, to give others information, to help others on their parts. And if you notice, this energy, this is so wonderful, and this is why I use it, the fairy energy, because the fairy um, energies help people with business and their careers, okay? And what is transpiring is that this is a major arcana, and this is the energy of judgment. Now, this judgment is that this is positive in a work situation because I see some of you are looking for your mentors or going to find your mentors or are going to become a mentor to, to people and younger people. This is really a wonderful, positive alignment of energies. Um, Sagittarian, this is a good, this is a real positive alignment of energies that is going to be coming up this is wonderful because this is going to be creating really abundancy in your world and this is going to be good so saggy it's as if i find the right space for you guys let's see so archangel raphael universal angels and guides please come in um please show us up show us the energy that is happening and transpiring in business and career wealth and money for the Sagittarians in this period. Alrighty. So we see um, seven of swords, some deceptiveness. Um, uh, and this is going to be in the bottom. Um, some deceptiveness um, that some of you were dealing with. Uh, with a, um, uh, a situation where you're standing your grounds. And um, whatever this decept deceptiveness and whatever this, this situation is and this deceptiveness, you are dealing with the air sign people and you're dealing with you. You are standing ground and I see that you're dealing with young um, water sign people. And these are situation that is affecting at work. Now, I see a tower moment is coming down for 
someone who have uh, created some deceptiveness, okay? And this person could have created deceptiveness uh, um, together with a water sign person. Now, as we look at the basis, and especially in the month of April, whatever that this um, person, because 777, um, this is, you're on the right part. So um, some of you are going to be finding out that either an Aquarian or a Leo has been not very honest. And I see that you're going to be um, creating honesty between these two people. So it could be a conflict on the work floor where um, you're seeing some deceptiveness. You're going to be the mentor towards these people on the work floor because these people, there is some deceptiveness that is created, okay? Influence, this is um, information that was given. Um, and I see that some of you are standing your grounds and standing on your grounds. And I see that people are going to be respectful. I see some of you standing your grounds against a young, a young, um, um, person because they didn't speak the truth so whoever this young person is it is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person and I see they did not speak the truth okay and I see you're standing your grounds because some of you are dealing with um, a Sagittarian and you're realizing that um, a Leo and you're realizing that this Leo has not been speaking the truth so this is where the management power and the management uh, um, balance come in because you realize that this person have not been honest and i see that the truth is going to be coming out now whoever this person is and whatever that was transpiring this person is coming up um as you're going to be realizing that there are some younger people on the work floor um a, a scorpion and um a um, Aquarians that has been very very deceptive and has created a lot of deceptiveness um, in the work and around the work floor okay now what I'm seeing is that you are going to be um, creating a situation to release yourself um, from these issues between these two persons now this person and the situation is people from past life that you're working karma out with, but you realize that these people have been very, very deceptive. Whatever the issue, the situation is, you're realizing that these people have been very deceptive. So a scorpion could have done something deceptive, and I see you're turning your back to this person, the situation, and I see you're standing your grounds, standing your grounds and also turning your back to a Leo. So these three has been really doing some in um some um they you know they could be stopping the workflow there could be creating issues okay and what we're seeing is that you're moving forward but there are some a new start moving forward but there are information that you are not aware of okay so whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring. Sagittarius, you got to keep your eyes open um, in this um, this three months, especially um, in the month of April, because you're going to be um, realizing and understanding that there has been some deceptiveness at play. And it is created um, by people on the work floor or people that you're associated with in business. That information that you have received in the past was not correct. So it's as if now you're going to be finding out that there was some information that was in the past that you have received was not correct. And it has to do with and uh, Sagittarian um, and another Aries person that an Aries person had a lot of secret, that an Aries and a, a, a water sign person had a lot of secrets that you were not aware of. So um, it's as if you make a decision and you have done something that created um, like an influx of, a, so you had to, you had to, uh, you, you try to win something by doing something deceptive 
in the past and now it's coming up now i've now i see um that you're realizing the play that has transpired that um a scorpion an aquarian and a leo have done some deceptive uh, move whether um created some issues against another um employer employee and now it's it's, it's and, and you make an action because you believe these people and you made an action and now you're realizing that you made the wrong action now you're realizing that you made the wrong action so there is a definitely a lot that is going to be transpiring and i see some of you are going back and thinking about the actions that you have made um you know a couple of years ago or the you know you try to create um the flow of uh, um you know effective flow whether in um your work life you're in your business but now you're realizing that people weren't being very honest and especially the water sign people around you have been having secrets the cancers have been having secrets there's a young cancer around you have been having secrets and i see you're going to be getting to the bottom of this young cancer secrets because you realize that there is more beneath the high so it's as if you're running a corporation running it in and, and people aren't speaking the truth and you will realize the lies and deceptiveness from an Aries. So an Aries and a Leo has created some lies and deceptiveness. And I see that it is coming out. So you, um, you Sagittarians are like, oh my gosh. Okay. Um, now I'm seeing, and you could be realizing that they have sort of a con you in a situation you were conned in a situation and now you're realizing oh so the sagittarius and the leo was always working together and now you're realizing the secrets that these uh, uh, people have been holding and kind of con you in a corner where you make uh, um opportunities and door um open for these two and realizing that they were lying all the time. So it's as if you got burned, um, Sagittarian, and you are going to be going to the bottom of this because you, you uh, are realizing, oh my gosh, I did something in order to create, a, um, you know, new doors of opportunities, business opportunities, and that sort of a thing, which wasn't true, um, which these people had gave me false information that makes me make the decision in this business deal or this uh, corporation or this, uh, um, you know, department. You could have been the head of a department. You could have been a manager in a company. You're trying to help younger people. It could be that you're a professor or a teacher. And now you're finding out the lies and deceptiveness that a Leo and an Aries have been working together. And I see that you are going to be finding out their secrets in order to release yourself out of a situation that you have gotten yourself in and you need to release yourself because you realize that this business deal this um contract that you had with these people was created in illusions and it has to do with a young um it's as if this young cancer was the one who contacted you in order to create a, a sort of uh, um uh, yeah i know two people uh, can you take them on or um you know they need help and so and you realize that this cancer is the person who have a um conjunct this thing you're going to be realizing that a cancer a leo and a sagittarians they are friends and they are the one who created um and in illusions and get you trying to get these people in jobs and things and they're just playing a game um and and, and using people information and you get caught up in it so sagittarian oh 
there is a lot of deceptiveness around you in business and at work. So you got to keep your head down, Saji, and try to find out what exactly is happening because it is really playing out. Okay, Saji. So Sagittarians, um, however, um, this is affecting you in your life, whatever is transpiring. And however, this is affecting you in your life. You go, you got to understand that you need to make the right decision. You gotta go. 